Who are my friends? I'm shaking. Oh. Yeah. Hey friends, here's the Fossil Hunter. Welcome to this new video on my channel. And today we go fossil hunting here in the nature on the fields. And um, here we find all kinds of snails and shells which are around 30 million year, years old and there is oh here yeah. there's the first shell that's 30 million years old so it's from the Paleogene and Oligocene um, period and yeah this field is full of shell material and also there's a little snail piece there's the next shell yeah we will see ah yes oh it's a beautiful snail okay well we will see what we can find on today's hunt What a beast! That's huge! In comparison with the other. Oh. Nice find. And a second later, this one. <laughs> oh. Yes. Look at this piece. Beautiful piece and oh, man, massive piece. Beautiful, nice one. And all the white pieces here is shell material. All of this is fossilized shells which are 30 million years old. Oh, look at this. All the white pieces there. And there. There are shells which are 30 million years old. These shells are called, uh, the Latin correct uh, name is Gly Glycimerus. Hope I pronounced that correctly. <laughs> It's a beautiful little snail. Oh, look at the color. Wonderful piece. I think there is a bone. A modern bone. Oh, yeah. Nice toe bone. Look at this piece of shard. Quite interesting. I saw a modern bone of, I don't know what kind of animal this is. Maybe deer or, yeah, I don't know. If you have any idea, please let me know in the comments. And we will continue walking on this field and searching for um, for 30 million year old fossils so let's continue it's the first complete shell of this species nice one well my friends I saw a huge shell can you see this? It's a monster. Beautiful orange brown color. Yeah, I will take that. It's the next beautiful shell. Look at this.
beautiful pieces. Okay, I think there is the next big shell. Oh yes. Oh beautiful one. Complete. Yeah. I'm happy with that. That comes with me. So in the box. Nice. What a heartbreaker. Look at this monster piece of shell. Oh my gosh. This would be a monster beast. What a huge piece. I can see the structure of the shell here. Ah, what a heartbreaker. This would be gorgeous. Oh no, it's broken. Yeah, the tip. But look at the color. Nice. Here is another beautiful snail. Look at this. And it has a beautiful red, white color. Nice find. So that goes in the box oh, who my friends I'm shaking oh, yeah it's complete oh man that's the find of the day so far <laughs> we will see oh yes Okay, well, the box is full of shells and bivalves, but here is a beautiful shell. Pretty well preserved. And there is another one. Nice. Here we are at home and I cleaned all the fossils so I can show you them and what I want to tell you is that I split the fossil hunting trip in uh, two videos so you will see next week what I found at the second and third spot and if you have any questions all types I don't know uh, what you uh, thought about in the last minutes or whatever please let me know in the comments so I can answer them Let's start with the glycimerous bivalves and here you can see the sphincter, the muscle attachment of the shell, pretty well preserved. Here as well, this is the, I think that's my favorite one, with this strip with this one. That's the biggest, but it's broken. <sighs> Yeah, that's a heartbreaker, but that's it. And here you see the tiniest one I found. Other pieces and other big ones here. Yeah, the best snails. And this is my favorite. But I also found this one. And this big one. Yeah, some other species. These ones. These ones.
And this item is pretty cool. You see here the shell imprint, the imprint of a freshwater shell. And algae uh, settled around the shell and all this fossilized. So the shell and algae. So this is amazing, yeah, and um, this that's so incredible about the history of species of animals who lived a long time ago. Pretty, pretty cool piece. We have the oyster pieces. That's my favorite. I think there is a shell in the oyster. I don't know. Looks pretty, pretty cool. Uh, this thick piece. And this one. I'm pretty happy with that. Last but not least, the Naker shells I found also on the fields. And you can see the glitter, the Naker, pretty well. And these uh, pieces would be so large as my as my hand, but you can only find pieces because they are so fragile. You can see that. Yeah, they are so fragile, so you can only find pieces of them. I think I found beautiful pieces of history. When you have the same opinion, uh, please let me know with a like. And yeah, if you have any questions, um, write it in the comments below. And yeah, so that's it for today. See you next time. <music>